Hey, what's going on? My name is CarQ, and today I'm going to bring you 23 tips, 23 heroes, all in two minutes. Let's go. You can animation cancel Dragon Blade Slash with a Swift Strike. High Noon shoots right to left, so you can move your screen to avoid a reflecting Genji. Use Concussive Blast into Jump Jet at a spawn to regroup with your team faster. Animation cancel with Melee while you reload to fill dead time. Tactical Visor refills your ammo. Go invisible before you throw your translocator to get in really good flank positions. Here's one of many flanks that Tracer is capable of. You can rocket jump during your ulti by shooting below you, followed by a jump. Scatter arrow at an enemy's feet or narrow corridors because it's simple geometry. Rip tire makes less noise when it's not spinning against the surface. Remember, you can change your wall orientation by pressing the wall button twice. Here's a couple good examples. Build your turret deep in enemy territory on defense, on assault, payload, and hybrid maps for free ulti charge and none for the enemy since the Sombra patch. Jump again at the end of a vertical hook to go even higher. You can choose to melee instead of primary fire to cancel your booster jet. Jump at the end of a charge to carry momentum forward and regroup with your team quicker. Hook and turn right or left 90 degrees while strafing in the same direction to pull enemies closer. Jump again after leaping to carry momentum forward and regroup with your team quicker. You can rocket jump by using right click and jump almost simultaneously to get in a better position. If you land a sleep dart, the proper execution is shoot, bionade, shoot, melee on squishy targets. Sound Barrier has multiple pulse waves, so as long as you're within the line of sight of a teammate even near the end of it, you can still give them the shield. Mercy can automatically reload her gun with her staff out as long as she waits the normal reload time. Try not to bundle all your sentries in one easy to see area. Spread them out into hard to see places. And for the final heroes in Yada, you can still track discorded enemies without line of sight for 3 seconds, so use this to charge a right click. Anyways, thanks for watching, that was 23 tips for 23 heroes in 2 minutes. Let me know what you think about quick 2-3 to three minute videos like this by commenting down below, and while you're at it, hit that like button and subscribe. Take care.